Hello everyone, today I'm going to review a game played by the winner of Group B of the IJ League. Black player is John C. Tudan and white player is Shin Jero E. Fridan. Alright, let's get started. Black player started with a Chinese opening and black started uh, building a very huge moyo and the sequence went like this. This kind of moyo game is so hard to evaluate, right? So um, once the border line is determined, we cannot go back, right? So uh, we should be careful about playing this uh, moyo game. Um, now white played away, but White has this weakness, so with this move, White could have played on the upper side like this. Yeah, White can cut and fight. White played away. And this is a Joseki, but White player extended, but this is the right move. Black can play Atari and Black can capture these two stones, then um, this is uh, normal. But the actual game, I played this extension. Then you see, in the previous uh, variation, white got sente, but in this case, white lost sente. In this case, white lost sente, right? So that's why, uh, in this case, this is the only move. Probably white player have, has no um, experience of this joseki, right? So this is the actual game. Uh, actually, this move is a jealousy move, right? I can say this is a jealousy move. So in this case, um, yeah, this one soon is so big, right? And if I want to play on the upper side first, as I told you, this cut is very severe. And after this exchange, I can go back to uh, the upper side. Yeah, actually, this, you see, this cut is very, very powerful. So I should defend this weakness somehow. The actual game, black answered, but with this move, I could have just ignored this move. Actually, this cut is very severe, so if black defends this weakness, then later black can cut. This is also a very um, good follow-up. And even if white plays the right side first, black can keep attacking this group. Yeah, this is extra game. White cut, and after this, white defended this weakness. But this exchange was not good. I mean, uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, or this exchange. This exchange was not good because, yeah, we can compare this with uh, this variation. Yeah, without this exchange, white could have defended this weakness. Then for black, this is the best, right? Then in this case, white can save this group as well, right? Then I can save these two stones, but yeah, remember this shape, but the actual game went like this. Yeah, after this, black pushed here, and the sequence went like this. Yeah, as you see, now that black has a stone over here, so black has this cut, right? So, I mean, black managed to have some power toward the upper side. So for white, uh, this exchange, one, two, three, four was not good, okay? If white answers like this, then probably white player thought like uh, this group would be in danger. But uh, with this move, uh, white can save this group, no problem. So the actual game went like this. This exchange was not good for white, so black was happy with this sequence. Yeah, this code was not necessary. 
end. This is the extra game. This is uh, okay. And the problem was the upper side. Yeah, this is a joseki. Um, but when black push it, so far so good. But uh, with this move, white could have uh, blocked like this. Then as you see, the upper side is not that small. So white could have um, played like this, but white tried to make a tiger's mouse. But uh, even at this moment, white, of course, white could have answered like this. But uh, suddenly, white player played away. Uh, probably, white player thought like this is a sente, or white player um, thought like the left side is big, right? But uh, white should answer on this direction. But the problem of this tiger mouse is black has some Aji on the upper side. Something like uh, black can push and black can pip and yeah. Black can play. Black can aim at some Aji on the upper side. So suddenly white player played away. Yeah, before the game was very uh, close, you know. But uh, after this move, uh, black started leading, but actually for black, this one stone was just big, you know. After this, black player could have just uh, answered like this, then since this one stone is so big, then this was good enough for black. But black player tried to do something on the upper side, and actually it was not that accurate. So, but after this, um, for white, this was a huge mistake. White could have just saved this one stone, then white could have captured the upper side, right? Then it was a very close game. But suddenly white uh, sacrifices the upper side. Yeah, white should answer this part because there is this cut. So this, the sequence went like this. Yeah, suddenly um, black managed to capture the whole upper side. Yeah, so now uh, suddenly um, it seems like the game uh, is over. Yeah. But after that, there were several significant events, but uh, let me shorten uh, this review here. Okay. So in this game, I wanted to show you about this uh, joseki. And in this case, this is a jealousy move. For white, white can just capture this one stone. And for white, this exchange was not necessary. White could have just uh, reinforced the upper side. And for white, white could have uh, focused on enlarging the upper side with this kind of sequence, but white missed this part. And for black, this one stone was big. Even after this, uh, white could have captured the upper side, but Suddenly, white sacrifices the upper side, so yeah, it was a big disaster for uh, white. But um, after um, a long sequence, uh, this game, the result was like uh, black won by just half points. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. And thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.